Hey, it's Danielle McCulley here in Seattle, also known as DMAC, and I want to make a quick video because I know some of you out there, especially those of you that have purchased the FSO harmonic scanner and the Agment scalping system, um, I know Dennis, he recommends that you have those on different platforms. And not only that, maybe there are some of you out there that, you know, you've already received your two downloads you're using one on a live account and one on a demo account well the thing about that it's totally fine but you cannot use your demo and your live download on the same MT4 platform so you have to have it on two separate platforms so in this video I want to show you how to download multiple MT4 platforms from the same broker onto your computer. Now we all know that you can have like different, you know, MT4, like I have JAFX right here and Trader's Way and whatever other ones you want to have, but how do you get multiple? Like I have two Trader's Way right here and I'm going to show you how to do that today because if you're using a live account and a demo account with the um, admin scalper, then let's say you started with your demo account and then you wanted to use your live account. Well, if you download your live account onto the same MT4 platform that you had your demo account on, it's going to deactivate the demo. So you can't use them on the both pla on the same platform. It just doesn't work. All right. So I'm just going to hop over to my downloads folder and we'll just do uh, the trader's way. So what you want to do, depending on who your broker is, you want to start the process. Okay. So, um, yeah, just click yes. But instead of going to the next step, and bear with me, guys, I just have a new Invisalign tray in, so I can't pronounce <laughs> words that good. So please bear with me, okay? So instead of clicking on next, you want to click on settings. I can't even stand myself the way that I sound right now. But anyway, okay, I'm going to make it through this video. <laughs> All right, so once you click on settings, um, you, this is irrelevant. I mean, this just means if you leave this check, once you complete the download process, it's going to automatically open the MQL5 community website. So you can uncheck that. But the main key here is to um, go up here where it's going to download the MT4 platform and as you can see the name this will be the name here so what you want to do is you just want to name it something different so let's say you can say traders way metatrader 4 I don't know dash demo account and then once you name it something different, then you will click next. I'm not going to do it because I've already um, have Traders Way on here twice. So, but you will, um, yeah, just click next and then continue to go through the process. So after this is done, um, let's see here. After this is done, you know, you should get two that pops up. So you have the regular Traders Way. This was the first one that I downloaded and then I downloaded one for um, one of my other accounts, uh, a business account here. And that's it. So once you receive your download link for your live account and the one for your demo account, you will then click on one, use one for your live account. So let's say you want to use this one for the live account. And then let's say you want to use whatever it is that you named it, demo account. You use that one to upload your demo account. So hopefully that makes sense. Um, if you still have questions, go ahead and type them below the video or just reach out to me on Facebook. But it's really simple. You're basically just going through the same setup process. But instead of downloading it to the same 
MT4 folder, you just have to give it a different name. And that's how you get the multiple platforms from the same broker. All right. So hopefully that makes sense to you guys. Um, yeah, that's it. Just wanted to show you that real quick because I know some people are wanting to know if they could use the FSO scanner and the Agment on the same account. You can, but I know Dennis does not recommend it just because it's going to bog down the MT4 platform and it will kind of make it run slow. So, um, yeah, this may fix that issue if you are having that problem. And for me personally, I use a um, VPS for my FSO harmonic scanner. So it's on its own private server, its own computer, totally separate from my laptop or my desktop. That way it doesn't have to um, slow down anything like that. And if you're interested in learning more about the VPS, again, just go ahead and reach out to me on Facebook. Um, we can chat it up and talk about that. All right, but yeah, that's how you get multiple MT4 platforms from the same broker on one computer. All right, so I am going to, uh, yeah, that's all I have for you today. And I will see you guys in the next video, which I'll probably make in a few days here. Um, I did get a chance to test out the new Agment last week. Um, still doing a little bit of testing, so I will be making um, a video on that soon to let you know what I think. All right. So hopefully you guys are studying, hitting those charts, um, going over some back testing, see where you went wrong last week or see what you did right. You know, like I said, there's no such thing as losing. Just a second here. Hey, sorry about that. Okay. Yeah, so basically that's it. I just want to show you how to download multiple MT4 platforms from the same broker onto your computer, laptop, or whatever it is that you're using. And yeah, just uh, stay tuned. Um, I will be making an Agment review video of the 2018 version. So um, be on the lookout for that. And I will see you guys in the next video. All right. Have a good weekend.